activation exercise number three. This is gonna be for the obliques, for the side walls. So we're gonna be using a med ball for this, and we're gonna do a Russian twist. Now, a lot of times when people do this Russian twist, they go right into it, they lift their feet up off the ground, and they kind of twist the flail around and go back and forth. We're not gonna do that. Again, we're moving slow and controlled. We're just trying to learn how to activate the abs and see what it feels like. So we wanna go much more controlled, and I urge you to keep your feet on the ground to start, and sort of start with even a lighter med ball than you might be used to. So when it comes to this exercise, the closer the ball is to us, the less leverage it's gonna have against us, the less work our abs are gonna be doing. The further away from our body it is, the more leverage it has against us, the harder our abs are gonna to have to work and our core's gonna to have to work in order to hold it. So again, back flat is what we don't wanna do. We wanna kinda of keep a little bit more of a rounded back and that's okay. It's gonna put a little stress on our lower back and just like the reverse crunches or even regular crunches, yes, doing thousands of repetitions is not gonna be great for your back, but if you want six pack abs, you gotta round your back and you gotta squeeze those abdominals. And that's why the first phase focuses on core strength. So to make sure your core is strong enough so when we are doing these exercises and rounding our back, we're not gonna hurt our back. All right, so again, feet are gonna start on the ground. We're gonna lean back. If your back's not completely flat, that's okay. A little bit of a round is fine. We wanna keep this med ball a little bit away from our body. We're gonna grab it and we're gonna move in a slow, controlled manner. Eyes are gonna follow the ball and we're gonna move around to the other side. I don't want you to tap the ground because I want you to feel what it feels like to hold the ball away from our body like this and feel those obliques working and holding. And then we're gonna go right back around. You're also gonna feel this quite a bit in your hip flexors here and here, that's okay. So we're, our abs are stabilizing as we're moving and then we're working with the twist to work the obliques. All right, so I'll show you what it looks like full speed. You're gonna kind of see, it's still nice and slow and controlled. We're not moving too fast, we're not rushing the movement because again, we're just learning how to activate the abdominals and we're learning how to do this correctly. If you work up to it and you can lift your feet off the ground, I'll show you what that looks like as well. That's great, that's awesome. But again, make sure you can control the weight and you can move in a control manner, okay? So I'll start with my feet on the ground. Now I'll lift them up. If you start to tire, just get that med ball a little bit closer to you and it's gonna be a little bit easier. is abdominal activation exercise number three.